well, well, well. We are here to present Luis and Quinn for winter semifinals. What is up, y'all? Everyone at home watching. This is winter semifinals for GLS 128. I'm here with Arkister. What's up? Sorry, I had to sneeze as soon as we sat down, so I was like duck, trying not to die as soon as I unmuted. I feel you on that, man. So, Luis in town. That's lovely to see. I think uh, going to Psycho Smash coming up. Yeah, we got NorCal in the building. A lot yeah. showing up tonight. Playing pretty well, but Luis, the one sitting here in winter semifinals against Quinn San Diego, also pulling through as well as LA. Like, we got everyone from all over. It's a pretty good turnout tonight, too. I will say, it's been a while since we sh we have so much love shown to GLS. So, shout out to everyone showing up from out of town. And what do you think about the Rob, first of all, from Luis? It's, uh, I don't want to say unorthodox pick, but not your everyday pick. I know it's something, like, from the times I watch Dota House, I've been seeing it kind of often. Like, it's definitely got some practice on it. Tried and true. But Quinn gonna take the first stock off of Luis. Gonna extend a little bit with these up air combos. Oh, that's not gonna do a great DI from Quinn. Oh! I'll see you guys. All right, Red Fox, keep it up. You, you dipping out? Yeah, I'm dipping out. Okay, let's go. All right, up the ass shield for Quinn, and that's gonna be some big damage opening up, but. Luis gets some landing damage on the way down, 80% already. He has to find a way out of this corner. Great burner into the air dodge. It's not going to be easy whatsoever for Luis to come back. Quinn holding on to this lead by a chokehold and taking that oh, stock immediately. Under that there. Oh my gosh, I thought he was dead. Wait, okay, he has gas. Pause. Ah, doubling down on that up, he get the fuck off of me. Yeah, bro, just keep landing right if they keep landing on you. Stop doing it. Luis low-key with the Samus problem. Is that going to try to give us the insider info? Tries for the down on the up. He doesn't find it. Goes for the double dead, but once again, it's Quinn fighting his way out. I will say, these are two Palutena's that ended up just saying, nah, fuck it, we're not going to play Palu. That's a good point. Like, they're both... They're both well balanced. known for the Samus. I mean, Quinn, as of late, has frankly been more. Oh, that was clean! Oh. God damn, the medium charged blaster into the F smash. Uh -oh. Quinn. Are we cheating? Low key. Out here? Nah, hold on. Why does this character kind of have sauce? Like, Samus is usually a sauceless character. That was clean. That was very cool. Stick into the Rob, though. So this is going to be our first best of five. Best of five, yeah. Yeah. So if anything, Luis gonna try to put one on the board with the Rob. If Quinn wins this next one, I expect to see uh, Palu switch. Is it a bad matchup for Palu? Like, what? Why not the Palu? It was playing so hot earlier against uh, uh, Skill. I honestly am not sure, but or something more than we don't feel more comfortable in the Rob matchup. No! Or maybe just feel so uncomfortable with the power that they go high. Have a try. How much gas does Luis have? All right, air dodges to the ledge. This, this blaster is just oppressive on the ledge trap. Fuck that. Keep that shit. We said, fuck that. Yo, Joe on the solo spam, bro. We get it. We got Rob on the screen for you already. Oh, oh, oh. Great tech there Why from Quinn. Yeah, surviving. Quinn tech that. But his stock was on borrowed time. Luis going to take the first one. Has Gyro yeah, in hand. Taking it in the end. That's not something you see from Rob. Yeah, that move's usually so steel. Now, I know you said Luis has been practicing this Rob, but I haven't seen any definitive combos coming out. Just honestly, this is pure fundies. He's playing pure advantage state Rob. Yeah, no, I unfortunately can't say I watch the North Carolina like, Guildhouse levels too much. Um, but where I find the time, I do try and like, pop in the stream every now and then. I've definitely seen the Rob before, so I know it's like not just a random pocket. Oh no. Getting grabbed, and I think Quinn has been playing phenomenal once it comes to the center stage. 
Grabbing onto the oh. ledge though. The oh, we got the wrong. Game. We got the, the wrong boss. Is going to take that stock, and Luis finally showing his hand, showing that he can get these combos down. I was saying like I haven't seen anything too crazy. Luis shut me up, real quick. Right now, this gyro play, impeccable. Oh nah, got your ankles, bitch. Grab your shit. Yo. <laughs> Loki, Robby grabbing your ankles and you're like, ah! <laughs> Yo, that's a crazy noise for a robot to make, bro. Right now, trying to chase him off there. The forwarder connects, still not enough to take this stock. Surprising, but not too much. Rob is pretty heavy. Oh, good air dodge on the stage. Quinn is ready for the mix. Jumps back, waits up the spot dodge, gets the hit one in there, and that move is so incredibly strong. Now, if I'm Luis, I'm finishing this right now because Quinn, with a little bit of confidence. Oh, bro, he he on demon time. Hold on, got your oh, ankles. Knows the roll away is coming. I like that gyro. Oh. You saw how he tried to fade back with the yeah. forwarder and it's still smooth? It's all of Kentucky, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think Luis played that second game great. Running it right back to Pokemon Stadium 2. Yeah, we, we got a set. We got yeah, a set now. Awesome. That's really important here. If you go down 2 0, you start to lose confidence in the secondary, I think. Now, let's see what Quinn has on the table in terms of adapting because it seems like in the center stage, he has been dominating pretty well. It just comes to the gyro play where he's kind of faltering. The gyro low-key fucking him up. Good up here, shield though, knows you can't dash attack. There's just this no fly zone around Samus. All right now. Trying to get a little more damage in, but can't get too much other than a one-two. Oh, oh with the mix-up, but just barely not far enough to get stuck in the rock in the hard place. All right, speeding things up here. The forwarder actually connecting fully extended on that. Bro went full set. All right, down throw. Goes for the up throw into the up here. Just going after the DI. He does. I thought he was dead, low-key. I'm fresh on the action, catching the neutral get up, okay. Wow. The confidence to go for raw up smash there as well. It, d it does cover multiple options, but still. The gyro, low-key adding insult to injury. How do you have to let cheers off? Just wait that like, out. Like, what the fuck, dude? But, like, get these balls away from me. Oh, we playing that game, huh? Win opted, just give it up, says, okay, we'll reset here. I got the charge shot. <laughs> you know what I said. Oh, be careful. I thought the side B was going to come out. Good spacing on the back here. Pretty safe, Rob, but not able to catch it. And the up tilt catches the high recovery. No, that was a very smart up tilt just to cover whatever option aggressively that Luis could have went for. And uh, now Quinn just trying to add up a little more extra credit, as much damage as he can get on this second stock. Ooh, sneaking his way past that fully charged blast. Oh, and the get up attack does get him out of it, but he does get caught. What the fuck? That shit was... Yeah. That there was disgustingly the long, extendo. bro. Not the extendo clip. It's coin miss. Right now, still too early to celebrate if you're Quinn. Now, one stock of peace. You're one gyro combo from going. Exactly, going bro. I'm saying this is no, prime percentage. Fine, okay, up throw. No, forward throw he here from Quinn. Oh, what the hell you doing? Why are you shooting, bro? Oh. No. This is dangerous, I Quinn, will don't be say. There. No! Okay, really good stuff. Not immediately going for the up B to get spiked there from Luis. Now, Quinn has been taking so much unnecessary damage here from Luis. What a gyro toss. No way, this is over? Oh, oh wait, no, double jump? 
Okay. Oh! <laughs> you disgusting monster, man. Yo, shout out to Cody in chat that goes, Quinn's gonna cook the Garrett to the blast zone. You were right, but you're a hater. That's crazy. Bro. Oh my goodness. I will say, what the fuck was he doing out there? But then he was like, you know what? I'm him. And I'm yeah, gonna I go like for the down That was so good. Now, Luis being forced to switch to the Palatino. We're not seeing the Sephiroth PK. The Sephiroth would have been disgusting, I will say that. Loki, just like Scintilla in the Blast Zone. Take that early stock. Not when you're down 2-1, he's not doing that. <laughs> All right now, we're going to see full arms at hand here from Luis. The whole arsenal. Oh, quick try and trick on the platform, but Luis not giving it to him, just keeping the pressure going. 82, the drag down up there gets beat by a Nair actually on the end. Oh, wow. Uh, Luis is playing dominant. Two parries in a row into a punish. Now, I wanted to say, Quinn does have a lot of knowledge playing against his own character as he, he, he has done so many dittos with Chase. True. But in this case, a whole different play style as well as he's not playing Palu, he's playing Samus here. I'd imagine he still has plenty of practice against Palu in the Samus matchup as well. Up air, he reads the double jump away, but he's not able to find it. I know he was trying to shoot that, but the fair just sneaking its way in. Yeah, he's being overly patient there. Could have pulled the trigger for sure. But I like this patience here from Quinn, just trying not to lose a stock. Immediately I mean, loses, loses it stop. to the dash attack. Great burst option there from Luis. When I mean, you're stuck in the corner like that, like, what do you do? You just like pray and hope and then just click a button. And you, God take the wheel. Well, like, let Goddess take the wheel, bro. That's Palutena right there. It's respect on her. My goodness. Oh, good back here. The Nair doesn't kill, though. That's surprising. Yeah, I am surprised that Nair didn't KO uh, 140%. I guess we're up there. I've never seen Palutena use up, though. That, was, that might be the first time I've ever seen that. Oh, my God. You're getting cooked, my boy. Quite literally with that explosive flame. I'll be beating out the down air on shield, but it's not enough to take the stock at 162. I will say the DI from Luis has been a lifeline. Being able to survive this long and add up so much damage and take the stock with the ledge trump. You blink and you miss it. Damn, shout out to the non-subs that got stuck with the Twitch ad right now. You guys are fucking broke. Pay for that shit. <laughs> Sub right now. <laughs> they can't even hear me. Only the rich people can hear me. Gift to sub right now. Ooh. Friends don't let friends watch ads. Gift to sub. Oh, we're getting the hell out of there. Quinn is getting dominated right now. Trying to find a way to take at least one stock off of Luis. Don't let this. No, what? Oh my god, where are you going, Luis? 201 and Quinn is just playing. You gotta Sorry, get one. Luis at least. is just playing phenomenally right now. Knows that the win condition here for Quinn. Okay. Knows that the win condition here for Quinn is please just let me up the yeah, ice field. Oh my goodness. Oh, we. Bruh, get one. No. We're really just letting that happen to us. 260%, that's a three stop. That was clean. Yo, and really, you got to think about those two situations where Luis DI'd and was able to survive to continue racking up so and much man, damage. I can't imagine it missing that set, bro. Why is Chase back there? Let <laughs> him win. But man, I couldn't imagine missing that game four. I know he's out there saying something, Highness. Highness? He's like, bro, what the fuck? Yo, Palmy, are we going Tekken? All right, right now. Stick it in the corner, man. Game five. 
We're going to see what happens here. He's sticking to the Samus. I can't blame him. It, it's been doing well, but after getting three stocked, there has to be some kind of adaption. No shine goes Quinzia. Yeah. Quinzia? Yeah, kind of outdated. I think Quinzia's retired. Yeah, kind of outdated. That's like a box of expired Rice Krispies, bro. Stale. Oh! Oh, that's the trade he was looking for earlier. No! No! <laughs> nah, bro. We're nah. Not <laughs> We're not letting that happen to us on game five, are we? I will say, I respect the fuck out of it. But from Quinn, there was no need to do that. Quick 47, easy peasy. Looking for the trade on the Nair. That Nair is so weird because of the way it trades with multi hits. It just soft spikes if you can't get your up caught. Quinn still struggling to take one stock from this Palu. Okay, okay. We'll get up attacking that one. Charging smash attacks at the ledge has been working for Luis. I thought he would do it again, I'll be honest. All right, now. Quinn got a stock! He got one stock. That's where it all starts. You start cooking from there, bro. He was on a light simmer, now he's on high heat. Okay. The air dodge was scary. Still surviving, only getting punished with the grab. Oh, that air dodge is actually getting caught. Yeah. Jumping from ledge again, so scary from Quinn. Okay. Get some off stage right now. Has the ledge trap started the charge shot just to force him on? He's looking for that down air. It's a rising up air from Luis. I thought that took the stock, but it's a quick jab, catches the roll in on reaction with the back air. I respect it. It felt like Quinn had to go for a big play to try to take the lead or even things up here. Yeah. So, considering how this all started, I would say 74% on Luis isn't too bad for Quinn to try to make up. But just Luis thinking the same thing, honestly. Like, you're only down, you're down a stock 84%. You got killed by a raw charge F smash so early on the first stock, and you're still keeping this close right now. You already know, though, Luis is not going to make it easy. He's fully locked in. Ooh, and there is the roll in, gets caught by the charge shot, and suddenly it's an even game, everybody. Game number five here, 8% onto Luis with that up BI shield. Oh my god, but just he's locked waiting. in into the waiting arms of Palutena. Quinn playing well on this ledge, He's getting punished with that back air. Yeah, that air dodge in gets caught by the grab every single time. Roll in, what gets around the auto right, tries for the death strike, you can find it. A little bit of a scramble here, both players just throwing things out. Ooh, oh, aggressive, aggressive option from Quinn. He catches the double jump, but he doesn't find anything after the upper. That's it? Does that jump kill? No, it doesn't KO, but he has no jumps. Makes it back onto the ledge. What's the play here? Trying to dodge this barrage of back airs. Oh, the dash check. Louis just a little bit late on the back air. Ah, that's scary Quinn. Quinn's choke. He had a lead, but he just started panicking every time he got hit. He wasn't ready for it. Respectable game five. 